Tesla just revealed the Model 2 interior, and it's nothing short of revolutionary. No buttons, no stalks, no clutter. Just an AI-powered cabin that thinks with you. Built from recycled biomaterials, a single screen, and a voice system that understands intent. This isn't a budget car, it's the future of driving. But could Tesla's thinking cabin be too smart for comfort? Let's dive right in. When Tesla's Model 2 first leaked from Giga Texas, most people stared at the photos. The compact frame, the wrapped prototypes, the tiny side mirrors that weren't supposed to exist. But the real story wasn't what you could see on the outside. It was what was quietly being built inside. A cabin so radically different that Elon Musk himself called it a game changer for the next decade. What Tesla has created isn't just another minimalist interior. It's a complete redefinition of what smart means inside a car. This isn't luxury for show, it's intelligence in motion. A cabin that learns you, reacts to you, and even anticipates you. It all begins with something deceptively simple. What it's made of. The 2026 Model 2 interior isn't stitched together from leather and plastic like every other car. Instead, it's born from a new biomaterial Tesla has spent years developing. A composite that's lighter, stronger, and 100% recyclable. Every surface you touch, from the dashboard to the doors, is formed from a single continuous mold. There's no glue, no paint, no toxic coating. The color is baked directly into the material itself. It's not just clean manufacturing. It's a statement. Tesla doesn't build interiors. It grows them. That one decision changes everything. Without layers of paint or adhesives, Tesla can recycle an entire cabin with almost zero waste. The process slashes material costs, reduces weight, and speeds up production across factories worldwide. What looks like a design choice is actually a massive logistical advantage. Proof that Tesla's innovation isn't just creative, it's ruthless in efficiency. Then there's the screen, the only screen. At the center of the cabin sits a 10.5-inch OLED panel, smaller than the Model 3's display, but twice as bright and infinitely sharper. It's not just a control center, it's the heart of the experience. All critical data, speed, navigation, autopilot, appears seamlessly on the lower windshield via a head-up projection system powered by Tesla's FSD V12 computer. The display adapts in real time, adjusting brightness and layout to match sunlight and driving conditions. You don't look at the screen anymore. You look through it. And while other automakers chase bigger touchscreens, Tesla went in the opposite direction, toward silence, simplicity, and speed. No buttons, no stalks, no clutter. Instead, the interface listens. It understands. And sometimes, it acts before you do. The real breakthrough is Tesla's new voice, AI. This isn't the voice assistant you yell at when your phone gets confused. It's a system trained on billions of real-world voice samples from Tesla owners around the world, fine-tuned to detect not just what you say, but what you mean. Tell it, set road trip mode, and the cabin quietly transforms. Seats soften, the temperature drops, and the audio shifts into immersive mode for long-haul comfort. This isn't pre-programmed automation, it's genuine intuition. A car that learns your habits and evolves with every drive. Elon Musk calls it the thinking cabin. But it's not about showing off technology. It's about removing friction between human and machine. Tesla wants you to stop operating the car and start communicating with it. That idea alone divides the crowd. Because if the car starts anticipating your needs, the question becomes, are you still in control? 
or are you slowly handing it over? That tension runs deep in every detail, including the steering itself. Tesla's new learning wheel removes the stalks and gear selector entirely. Instead, your hands touch an intelligent surface lined with motion and pressure sensors. The car measures your grip, torque, and reaction in milliseconds, adjusting steering resistance dynamically. Light and effortless in city traffic, solid and stable at highway speeds, the wheel literally learns how you drive. Internal data shows this adaptive steering cuts reaction time by 80 milliseconds. At 60 miles per hour, that's over 7 feet of saved distance, enough to turn a near miss into a clean escape. But even that performance leap hides a deeper genius. Scalability. The same learning wheel can fit left-hand or right-hand drive cars without redesign, cutting global production costs by 15%. Tesla isn't just changing how cars feel, it's rewriting how fast they can be built. Then come the seats, not redesigned, but re-engineered from the inside out. The Model 2's foam shell structure merges frame and padding into one seamless piece, eliminating nearly 40 components from the Model 3 seat design. That's lighter weight, lower cost, and less waste. But the real innovation hides beneath the surface. A grid of 120 micro-pressure sensors constantly tracks posture and adjusts lumbar zones in real time. Tesla's AI, trained on biometric feedback from over a million drivers, can detect early signs of fatigue and rebalance pressure before discomfort sets in. In testing, it reduced lower back strain by 23%, and improved circulation by 17% on long drives. This is comfort not as luxury, but as data. Your seat doesn't just remember you, it learns your body. Over time, it refines your driving posture to reduce tension and fatigue. Tesla isn't building cars anymore, it's building extensions of your nervous system. And just when you think it can't get more invisible, Tesla makes air itself intelligent. The new HVAC system eliminates nearly two-thirds of traditional flaps and vents, replacing them with 16 digital microvalves that control airflow with surgical precision. Cabin temperature is tracked at 20 points per second, keeping every zone within one degree of perfect balance. Whisper quiet, self-adjusting, and more efficient it consumes 15% less power than the Model 3 Highland, the kind of gain that adds miles of range most drivers never notice, but always feel. But here's the part that borders on sci-fi. You can speak to it, say, cool my left hand, and sensors detect your position, redirecting airflow within centimeters. Say, warm my feet, and the system quietly does it. You don't adjust your car anymore. You describe your comfort. And it obeys. Every decision, every feature of this cabin points to the same vision. A car that doesn't just serve you, but learns you. Tesla's engineers aren't designing components. They're designing relationships between human perception and machine precision. The Model 2's intelligence grows over time merging driver data from millions of vehicles into a constantly evolving network. Each car becomes a node, feeding Tesla's central brain with billions of data points. The more people drive, the smarter every Model 2 becomes. It's a brilliant, almost unsettling strategy. Because when every car shares intelligence with the entire fleet, individual experience becomes part of a global neural loop. Tesla isn't just selling vehicles. It's training a worldwide system of behavioral learning. The car that greets you in the morning might already know what thousands of other drivers did yesterday. And that brings us back to Musk's statement that this car is a game changer. He's right, but maybe not in the way most people think. The Model 2 isn't about luxury or affordability. It's about transformation. 
A $25,000 car that thinks, adapts, and learns, not from software updates, but from you. For Tesla, this is the final evolution of simplicity. Not more features, but fewer distractions. Not more control panels, but more connection. It's the first car that asks you to stop managing technology and start coexisting with it. Yet as Tesla pushes the boundaries of what a car can know, a quiet question lingers. When intelligence replaces control, does the driver still matter? Because for all its brilliance, the Model 2 is also a mirror, reflecting the future of human-machine trust. One where the more it learns, the less you need to think. One where convenience and autonomy begin to blur. And maybe that's the real shock behind Tesla's new AI cabin. It's not just building the future of driving. It's quietly redefining what it means to be a driver. And that's exactly why Elon Musk calls the Model 2 a game changer. It's not just a cheaper Tesla. It's a blueprint for how intelligence, simplicity, and sustainability will redefine the way we live and drive. This cabin doesn't just remove buttons. It removes limits. The same technology that learns your habits today could power autonomous fleets, space rovers, and off-world habitats tomorrow. Tesla isn't just building cars. It's quietly shaping humanity's next interface with technology. One that listens, adapts, and evolves. So, what do you think? Is this the future of driving or the first step towards something even bigger? Share your thoughts below. I want to hear your perspective. If you found value in today's deep dive, don't forget to like this video, leave a comment, and subscribe to Tech Revolution. Turn on notifications so you never miss the breakthroughs that matter. This is Tech Revolution, where we explore the innovations defining our future. Stay curious, stay inspired, and I'll see you in the next one. Tesla just revealed the Model 2 interior, and it's nothing short of revolutionary. No buttons, no stalks, no clutter. Just an AI-powered cabin that thinks with you. Built from recycled biomaterials, a single screen, and a voice system that understands intent. This isn't a budget car, it's the future of driving. But could Tesla's thinking cabin be too smart for comfort? Let's dive right in. When Tesla's Model 2 first leaked from Giga Texas, most people stared at the photos. The compact frame